Hey guys, and welcome to a new series of mine. It's called Miner's Dream, which basically I've already started building it, but basically it's a giant owl mine here. And we're going to be building it sort of like it was real. Like this, having fence post, having stuff holding things up, using TNT, and this is going to be a, like season one of a huge series I'm going to call Dreams, which is basically, it's sort of like how you, I don't know if you guys know, but a lot of people try and make there be a story behind Minecraft where it's like there was an apocalypse. This is basically people picking up. Not like the testificates where it's just small villages, but they're actually trying to pick up, get resources, bring back stuff. And you're starting with Miner's Dreams because um, you need resources. And I have a couple of things in these chests that aren't actually, I got them with creative mode, I'll admit. But the rest, the things that we're going to be getting to actually make this giant town, the cities and everything... It's going to be legit. So, yeah. And there are color rules. We can't leave a cave unsupported. And we, if there's a gap, we have to go over it. If you've seen, if you watch Etho, he did a sort of video where it was his realistic caving in his LP. This, the rules are sort of the same. Except we don't have to have a minecart going all the way down. So, yeah. And also, we only can use iron pickaxes. So I'm going to take these and here we have building materials I'm gonna take those the iron bars expensive as they are it's like say we run into a dungeon the people who have us have started all this they don't want monsters so it's a sort of oh this is dangerous stay away yeah so let's start mining slash me showing you around so it starts off with a sort of minecart track here, which is kind of useless, but whatever. And then you go into this um, four-way intersection, and I've already started this way. And yeah, let's start mining. Now, those of you who don't like mining videos, this is what it's going to be for this season. If you want to wait around for the next season, which I think it will come around after 15, maybe 20 episodes, it's going to be short. Maybe when we get rich, like say we get rich before the end of, um, before 15 episodes, then we're actually going to, um, do it later. So, yeah, and this is where the wood comes in, because we don't have the money to cover this up with stone. This is, we're trying to conserve resources, right? Right. So, yeah. Maybe this every four. One, two, three, four. Well, technically six, but whatever. And then, boom. So, there's that. And then we put the torches here. There. And these little holes, we'll keep them. Because, why not? Now. Um, things will be more exciting than this. Actually, I'm just clearing that. And now let's run back and get some TNT. Because... We don't want to waste our picks. Again, we don't have the resources, and this is supposed to be realistic, but we have a limited amount of resources. You don't want to waste your picks, I and mean, we have literally five picks. I'm not going to use diamond pickaxes, because that would be too expensive. We don't even have diamonds yet. We just recently blew up this place. So, there's a small village far, far away. Um, that has us doing this, and we get paid when we get done. They want to bring things back, like, to when there were skyscrapers, but that's where we come in. We have to make, bring stuff back to its former glory, and we don't have enough. Oh yeah, this is my miners get up, iron helmet, don't want anything to fall on our head, and then if someone's blowing stuff up, we want to make sure they know we're around, so... Orange. Yeah. And so... We're just gonna... Mine like this. You get a perfect square. 
whenever you mine like this, you dig in one and a bunch. You see this. There we- oh, we actually got the thing back. So I need to do it for- okay, hold on. Let me just move my food here. And here. One, two, three, four. Now, again, this series will get more exciting as we go, as I come up with more ideas. I literally was just making this board for fun, but oh! I'll make a mine. And I was like, wait a minute. I could make a series out of this. What's my sound turn up to? Yeah, let's turn it down somewhat. There. Music. There. I should turn the music off. Okay. So, this will evolve. Right now, I've just got the base idea. Mm, excuse me, base ideas. So, we're not going to try and use our picks that much. We'll Excuse me, we're going to use them to get stuff like um, iron and coal because we don't want to break the raw materials. Right. And you have a furnace room too. That was a little bit dangerous. Could have gotten a strike there. Not really. I don't have that set up yet. Or at all. I never did put these torches here so it doesn't get dark. And... Then, yeah, I don't know. Let's see. When we get to, oh wait, that was stupid. When we get to giant caves, this will get more exciting because we'll actually be looking around and we'll be having to put stuff like here. This what is a bit dangerous. That's why we put the big ones and big supports instead of these tiny ones. Yeah. <clears throat> And whenever we want to make an intersection, we go one, two, boom. Boom, and chaboom. Fire in the hole. Go! Oh, okay, this is where we run into a problem. Dirt is not something we want. So, let's blow this puppy into oblivion. Oh. Yeah. Just broke a rule. There we go. Iron! Now we're going to traditionally try and not do that because it's dangerous. It could make the cave fall in. Actually, I should probably be supporting this cave right now before we even start mining. Um, jeez. Okay. Um, hmm. Let's see if we can get back up. So, boom, 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 I guess I'm alone, I'm alone miner, boom, boom, eh, eh, so the idea of like the actual series of having a whole mining thing comes because my grandfather, you wouldn't know because I've never said it, um, he used to be a miner. So, yeah. Now, this is how we're going to hold it up, like, 4x4 four four thing. I should hold. If it doesn't, well, we're screwed. When we run into, gra run into gravel, we're truly screwed. So this, this hole is just going to stay here, because it's not very stable. We have a lot of dirt. It could cave in on us. We can keep it like this, but we don't want to actually... Go in there. Continue mining. Cause that would be stupid. Yeah. More iron. Oh, I can't get back there. Crud. So let's blow it up some more. Now, the problem with TNT is it's not efficient. We could end up blowing up some actual materials, but it's a price to. And little things like this, we're going to actually have to, um, sort of hope it doesn't cave in because we can't really, actually we can't, I just realized. I'm just going to put it here. Sort of messed up with the whole precision thing, which I guess we don't really need. It's like, like caves are going to really figure out. Yeah. Wow, big vein of iron. Oh, great. 
we just ran it ran into um dirt. Now here there's a lot of dirt. So that's why we are not gonna mine here anymore. Just pull up dirt. So let's take a break from mining for now and actually go and count our resources and it's not them. We need to make a smelting station actually. Oh it's night. I guess I should just sleep then. Humans have conquered the world to the point where there's no more monsters above ground, but spawners can still spawn them in. So we lock those off. Yeah. Nice to sleep sometimes. There we go. So let's go back down and have us and make the smelting station. Whoa. We've got enough cobblestone. Let's see. We need to build furnaces. We'll build about eight there. Now then, this is where things will start to get expensive because coal is a valuable resource. It's something that we need to make torches, and we're not. We don't have enough resources to go into the Nether. We don't want to die. And the human race, there's not much of a, there's not many of us. So, we all dive in the nether, then humans will be screwed. No, ooh, that was dangerous. Luckily it's hooked to the wall. We still want to do this though. So we've got about 24 coal. We want to smell all of our iron, even though we do have, we don't have quite a lot of resources. We could use wood, but that's something we need to use to build. So yeah, we're trying to be conservative. That's why we don't have flipping diamond tool sets, or we ne and we oops never will. Hopefully, we'll never need them. So we'll leave that to cook. And down here, this is the unexplored cave. It's a very unsafe. I mean, look at this. Unsafe. It is unsafe. So, for now, we don't want to go in there because we're afraid. Uh oh, we may fall. We may fall and die. We may die. Ow. Here was a little drill experiment. Actually, I need to cover up. We were testing TNT drills, which was not a good idea. We lost out. Two of us. Yeah, it was pretty bad. The um, little storage area here actually caved in and we lost some resources, but. Whatever. Well, not whatever, but... Yeah. Like I said, this is dangerous. Why didn't I actually say that? But still. So... The ravine over here, it's actually kind of dangerous, but we're not going down there. This area has enough supports so that hopefully if this were to cave in, I doubt it will, we'd be fine. I'm not going to get that high up iron because it's not worth breaking my neck. Over coal. Coal. This is quite. We have quite a lot of coal in this area, which is a good thing because we need coal. We have iron too. We want emeralds as well, but we're not near uh, that type of area. The boss he wants gold, so that way we can start making golden nuggets and um, have a currency. But that's going to take some time. We're still not deep enough. We need to go deeper. Yeah, so, not nether deep, but deep. So, we're probably going to start that next episode, guys, but, um, yeah, this is the start of a new series, Miner's Dreams, and I've been Wedget, and you guys will see me later.